I forgot to turn on the lamps. Lamps. We need lamps. Hey everybody, it's Bunny and it's time for everybody's favorite day of the week. The day of the week when we ask ourselves, does this thing really work? And today we are testing out a cup, the right cup. And I have been so excited to test this thing out because every year I vow that I'm gonna be healthier and then I'm gonna drink less soda and less sugary drinks. And then you know that I've got like the willpower of a flea and so I'm always right back like drinking my Pepsis and my sodas and my Cokes and whatever. Let me just show you guys the entire tray because it is impressive. We have five different right cups to test out today. I feel like I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself and I'm not quite explaining what these things are. This cup is actually supposed to be a way to trick your brain into thinking that you are drinking a delicious flavored beverage when in fact you are only drinking water. They have five different flavors. Let's go ahead and look at them now. They have orange, mixed berry, peach, apple, and then the last one, which I think might be a little bit funky, is cola flavored. Hmm. It is supposed to be great for people who aren't supposed to drink a lot of sugary drinks, people that have diabetes, or if you're trying to get kids to drink, you know, um, like water. I don't think these cups are cheap. I was just trying to relook up my receipts. I believe that they are $29 a piece. I believe I bought this package, which was $115, and I got all five cups because I wanted to be able to tell you guys which flavors I thought were the best, which flavors I thought were the worst. I kind of think that I might like orange the best. How it is supposed to work is from using smell and taste. So when you are holding the cup anywhere around your face, you can smell what flavor it is. And then this ring on the top is supposed to taste like the flavor that it is. So when I put my mouth on this plastic, it's supposed to taste like oranges and smell like oranges, thus tricking my brain into thinking I am consuming an orange flavored drink. They said that this took six years to engineer and to get it right and I'm pretty excited. So I just have plain bottles of water here and you don't have to do anything special. The only thing that they do say is don't put the cups in the dishwasher or the microwave or anything like that. But all you're supposed to do is pour the water inside of the cup and uh, magic is supposed to happen. They also say that the more that you use these cups, the stronger that the flavor will become because your brain will sort of like adjust to the senses, I guess. Cheers, Swamp Family. I wish you guys could smell and taste with me. It's so interesting. It kind of smells like, kind of like synthetic orange is I guess the best way to put it. Like it doesn't smell like I just like cracked open a fresh orange, you know what I mean? I'm kind of nervous that I'm not gonna like it, but let's get sassy. Let's try something today. Let's try something new, I'm excited. That's kind of weird. Okay, as I was tasting it, I was like, wow. Nothing's happening. After I stopped drinking it, I did have the aftertaste of oranges. I don't know what's going on here. I feel like it's almost equivalent to like holding your nose and then like drinking water really fast. Or like I used to do that when I was a kid, if I had to like swallow like a really yucky medicine or something, you know, you hold your nose and you like just pour it back and get it over with. I don't feel like all of a sudden I'm drinking Sunkist or orange juice or anything like that. It does sort of feel like I'm tricking my brain, but it's not like creating a flavor in my mouth. I don't know why I expected that to happen. Like just all of a sudden I'm drinking orange juice, <laughs> but it's water. Like I really, where do my expectations come from? I don't know. I'm gonna take one more sip of orange, and then we're gonna move on down the flavor train. I definitely feel like it's more convincing if I breathe in as I am drinking the water. I don't know. It's not very strong. It's not as strong as I thought 
it would be. Up next, we're going to test mixed berry. And I don't know what berries the mixture is supposed to be. Let's see if it says anywhere on here. So it shows a picture of like raspberries, blackberries, and blueberries. So I think those are the berries that are supposed to be mixed. I'm scared that this one really isn't gonna taste like anything though because I feel like the scent is less powerful in this one than in the orange one. I don't know, let's see. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, that one's, that one's not, is this like the most boring review ever? Um, it doesn't really taste like much. I feel like maybe this one, even though it smells weaker, it sort of had like a stronger, I feel like my mind is being blown. It's like, it's not changing the flavor of the water. I feel like that's kind of like, maybe that's why they say feel the taste on the box instead of like taste the taste because you really are not tasting anything. It is more of a sensation, but I will just say like I feel like I can get the water down easier. That's kind of like a spoiled thing to say because like just think of all the places where they don't have the luxury of like drinking boring water, you know? I don't know, like is this gonna make some people mad? I feel like it is. I mean, I'm just generally not excited about drinking water, you know? I'm not like, oh yeah. Up next we have peach and this one is very scented, so maybe we'll get more of the effect with this one. Special effects, water, all right. Uh, I'm trying to just taste the cup. Just licking plastic now in today's video. <laughs> when I just stick my tongue on it like that, you do, you do start to taste a tasty flavor. <laughs> you do start to taste the flavor of whatever you're tasting. Maybe I don't drink water right. Am I supposed to like, Dang the guy like that. Maybe I just drink wrong because it does create more of a flavor. Like if I like, do you guys see how I'm drinking right now? Like if I like go like that <laughs> and then drink the water, right? Like, but does anybody drink like that? I do feel like in that way, you do get more of the flavor if you just stick your tongue right on the plastic side. Then I'm like, oh, it tastes like peaches. And then the smell kind of makes me think that I'm tasting peaches. I don't know, you guys, but I definitely am not like, oh my God, my life is changed now. You know what I'm saying? You know, you know what I mean? Uh, up next, we've got apples. And it's Swamp Family Green, so I'm very excited. This one's really strong too. You guys, I feel like I kind of choked from drinking water weirdly on the peach cup and now like, oh, it's like stinging my throat. I'm such a baby. <sighs> okay, I feel like if I do sippy sippy, I really can't taste the flavor, okay. Mostly I'm just tasting the fresh, crisp taste of water. I feel like water does have a flavor, correct me if I'm wrong. And I know that this is gonna sound really like, you know what I mean? But like, I can taste the different flavors between the different bottles of water. Like if I drink Ozarka or Evian or Fiji or Aquafina, like they all have a different flavor, right? And the last one is the semi-dreaded cola. I think that this one might taste a little bit freaky and I'm sort of having flashbacks to like when we did the soda stream. You guys remember that? I feel like that was one of the OG does this thing really works. One of the greatest of all times. Legendary. I'm trying to determine what sort of cola this uh, is supposed to be flavored like. It just sort of has that spicy coldy, coldy smell. Oh wow. Okay, oddly enough, this is the strongest flavored one. How weird is that? I guess I had to go through the whole, the whole, all five of them before I got one that was truly flavored, flavor flavored. That's weird. It's like I can still taste water, but also I am tasting a cola. I don't know how I feel about that. I feel like it's because this one is the strongest in scent. So it's sort of like when you're putting your nose like into the cup to drink, your your nose is sort of like just being infiltrated with 
cola smell. Was this a really boring video? You just saw me drink water like 27 times. I don't know, I'm kind of on the fence about this. I definitely want to keep using them and maybe I should give you guys like some sort of update, like at least on Snapchat or something. Like I really thought this was gonna be like a bam pow in your face, kind of like whoa, like video for does this thing really work? And I feel like it's just kind of like expectations, reality kind of moment. I definitely am curious to see if like maybe if I drink out of these more often, like will my brain start to detect a stronger and stronger flavor? I do have some sensation, but it's not kind of like, like kind of how I thought that they meant is like you literally thought you were tasting or drinking an orange flavored beverage. It's not really like that. Like mostly, like probably nine out of 10, the flavor that I'm tasting is water. For some reason though, when I am drinking out of these cups, I am more encouraged to finish each glass of water. I don't know why that is. I don't know if it's because I'm just like, ooh, I wanna see if I taste it. Do I taste it now? Do I taste it now? And then the next thing I know, like I've drank an entire cup of water. So I don't know if it's just kind of like the curiosity and the fascination of it all to see like how flavored the water will get will promulgate you to drink more water. I have been so excited to do this one for a really long time. I just love testing devices out like this that are so different and interesting and you don't really know what the results are gonna be. I will have to give you guys an update and let y'all know if over time, maybe I'll put it in my next monthly favorites and I'll let you guys know. Thank you guys so, so much for hanging out with me today and for watching. Don't forget if you've got a suggestion or an idea of a product that I should test out in this segment next, leave it as a comment down below. Also, do me a favor and check and make sure that you're still subscribed if you want to be subscribed because pretty much every night at 9 p.m. all of a sudden like it, it deletes like a thousand, two thousand subscribers and I'm just like, what's going on? What's going on? Everybody gets together at 9 p.m. lately and I guess unsubscribes from my channel and every other YouTuber. I don't know what's up with that, but Thank you for being here and for spending some time with me. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit that button down below, subscribe, become a member of the Swamp Family and give an alligator its wings. Also, if you want, you can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash Graveyard Girl, or you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or Instagram at Graveyard Girl. Same way it's spelled here. I love you guys so, so much, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye. I'm excited. I'm excited. Hit me with those oranges. Okay. Eh.